all thank you so much for taking time to speak to us we know that you have been doing a lot of awareness camps and a lot of social service activities so if you can please brief us about some of the activities that yeah. you do I have been inspired by my parents and teachers to do the community service activities because we came from a village background. So in our country we see that many of the people are unable to come to the doctors unless they become patients and get complications then only they come to the hospitals. If you go to the community, if you go to the normal people, if you do the free health camps, lot of people who are not affordable to come to the doctors, they'll come for the screening and we can detect complications very early. So gradually over a period of 25 years, thousands of camps we have been conducting. Later we understood that rather than conducting the free health camps, health awareness scams are giving more importance and we are going to the government schools municipal schools and all the educational institutions universities concentrating on the women and girl children health hygiene menstrual hygiene then we entered into the self help groups where we have been telling about the cancer screening programs each and every camp each and every program will teach a new lesson for us how to improvise ourselves and how we can do best and in the covid it has given a new dimension that we have entered into the all sorts of the media like print and electronic media all india radio social media youtube video short videos which has reached lakhs and lakhs of people and they many people come and express their gratitude that because of your video i think our life got saved that has given me the inspiration to do more work in the community thank you ma'am i think you are really adding value to the community as a whole and for people who have less accessibility to these things it's so important um in continuation to that you also do education uh, programs for healthcare professionals and things like that so if you can brief us about yeah that. initially i was in teaching but i left because of the personal reasons but the zeal and enthusiasm has not subsided then every time i started giving lectures to all our colleague doctors and improvising myself not that i they don't know anything each and every lecture i will prepare more i learn more and i will translate my knowledge into the practice now for the past few years i am into the national faculty when we attend the conferences we know how to speak and what are the other skills we can learn from our seniors and we can translate into the ground level to all the local practitioners also so this is the best way of learning by teaching to our fellow doctors yes no i know we agree i think apart from just attending conferences to share knowledge one to one with uh, experts also matters you learn in the process as well uh, so and you also hold a national level role in terms of creating again uh, awareness for can you speak to us about that role as well yeah please? actually i am the only lady lady physician in both telugu speaking states of telangana and andhra pradesh to reach at a national level i am the national api credentials committee member for 23 to 26 i am i have been actively in the national women doctors wing of ima and i am also playing the active role in rssda and i think recently i have been appointed as the non official independent director for bayrak under the department of uh, biotechnology ministry of science and technology government of india it's a pride for a women doctor coming from a very remote place of this country picked up by the prime minister office and the entire credit goes to all my fellow doctors in api rssda and ima who made me a from a normal doctor to an academician to an organizational leader and to such a high level where i will be useful for my all doctors in assisting in the research grants and i'll be more useful in getting the more research in our country into the action Thank you ma'am I think wishing you all the best in your role I'm sure you'll go from one eye to the other Thank you Thank very you. much Jai Hind